holding that data, right? Somebody organizing that data, putting it in the boxes, right? And really collating and holding all of that has to be one person's job and one person's responsibility. So I need to be able to pick up the phone and ask this person, in June 2012, I want to know how many children were diagnosed. And that person can access the database and be able to give you that number. And we shouldn't be scrambling in 100 registers to be able to find it. We don't need fancy software for any of this. Simple Excel is more than enough. To begin your monitoring processes, simple Excel is more than enough. Okay, after that we can start, you know, investing in slightly more complex and, you know, uh, cloud-based platforms. But current, like if you want to start off, all of us, most of us have land in our organization. So there is a server within the organization, we know we can access it, right? So it's absolutely fine. And of course, Google Docs is fantastic. So, Google Docs is fantastic. Analysis, again, if we do not have the funds, if you are the data analyst, you please make sure it's there as part of your job role. You are doing it. Every month you are looking at the data and preparing a report. Even if nobody but yourself reads the report. Right? Currently maybe you do not have an evidence based culture and you are going to read the report and nobody else. Doesn't matter. Make the report nevertheless. So which is why, you know, putting, putting this down yeah. as practice, where in your first Monday because of the month. Because we are month, not able to write and document it. Because so, I worked in NGO yeah. sector also. Right. So I understand it is, you feel, you know, you are tied up with so many activities. Yes. One person is doing too much That's of work, you know. Which is they why we need to write. X, Y, Z. I agree. And last priority is writing and document. True. So, Basically, it's just, it comes down to simple rituals that we can put yes. into our organizations. You know, first Monday of every month, yes. right? You're going to share what happened the previous month. One little scorecard for each department with the key, the goal, key indicators over there written out. It's a simple little scorecard that's presented first Monday of every month. Like simple little ritual, right? There will be lots of hiccups. Your first few reports will mean nothing, will say nothing. It does not matter. Keep at it and automatically you will realize that people will start relying on that data. Mm -hmm. They will want to know, have referrals gone up? Has the number of children been diagnosed? Has it gone up? Right? Am I able to make sure that more ANC mothers are delivering healthy babies? Mm -hmm. Automatically you will be looking at the data. It's just a culture that we put in. How you know, initially how in school we have prayers? No, it's like that. Like right? It's a habit. You